So I made a quick break to check my notes. Um, I don't really want to lead you guys on and just uh, struggle through this. I mean, it is it can be difficult to remember how this works, but it's uh, it can be a bit complicated. Uh, basically, let's just have another couple of tries at that recoil. Hopefully, we'll find the no recoil. Let's press play. Uh, where were we? So something to do with recoil. I mean, it's just how it is. It's going to be so annoying. It's really bad. Um, so what I'm guessing is, so um, D A. Um, um, what I'm going to do um, is just going to keep going, and. Um, we're just going to keep following the steps and hopefully we'll find exactly what we're looking for. So don't worry about this ten for now. I mean, we did break the rules, but it doesn't really matter. We know that these have something to do with recoil, and they probably are. But these, the instruction of the recoil could be here, there, or just be a bit lower. But we will find it sooner or later. So we check this one out. What did this one do? So we did here, and I believe this was a... I don't know what it was, but let's just fill in nobs. And that's fine. Nothing happens there. And once again, let's just quickly uh, know up the ammo. Uh, da -da -da -da, binary phone, nope. So I apologize for this if I'm not going too much on track, but that's, there's no actual direct approach to these. It's just, like I said, trial and error, trial and error, and hopefully the video won't take too long um, explaining to you guys. So, black screen down to here. Um, I guess the idea is the more you do this, the better you get at it, but F sub, um, that's fine. So let's go FLD D word, we don't want to use those, those are stupid. Um, so don't touch those, just moves or adds or copies. Uh, or, or moves and copies are the same thing, but whatever. So just keep going down, look for any move D word, so let's try this one. So move D word. No crash so far, that's always a good thing. That's interesting. Da, da, da. I'm still getting some effect to do recoil. I mean, it keeps doing this on certain functions. Oh, never mind. See what well, we got there? Probably pushed us out of the map or something. Um, let's see if we can get away. Actually, we'll have to restart. There's no way around this one. Um, so let's just go assault cube. Ollie as usual. Come on, Ollie. God. Get off my back. Uh, let's just go back into the game. Press Ctrl G. Look for this. Press play. So, where is here? Seems to put you out of the map. Uh, so we leave this one alone. So movie the X move. Uh, EDX push layer ECX move ECX move D word. So let's go here and we're gonna go for binary. Actually, fill nubs. Yep, that seems fine to me. Seems fine. Once again, let's kill the nope. I mean, the um, decrementing of ammo. That seems fine to me. And that's fine. So that doesn't do anything. So let's just copy the text from here. No effect on nope. And then we go here and we say, um, I'm just thinking about this. Um, if this puts you out of the map, it means it's highly likely to do with recoil. So I'm guessing it's something. So the, the especially some of you guys have done Dark GDK before or any type of games programming, this makes a bit of sense. If it puts you out of the map, my guess is something is missing out. We know that that probably has something to do with recoil. So my guess is it's putting him out of the map. So I think it's fair to say. By blocking this one, these are still working, but they're using the values from these. So EDX, yes. Um, see, as you can see, EDX is getting used here. So we're gonna, what we're gonna try and do here, you can see this. Now the reason why we're killing it all the way down to call, as you can see here, EDX gets used and then it gets called here. So if we're blocking something, this is probably what was happening because it was calling without um, setting the value, and it was probably. Um, putting the recoil, so instead of giving a recoil, it's probably giving a negative value of sorts. So we knew the player shot, but there was no recoil stored down. So odds are the player was positioned miles outside the map. So what we're going to do is going to get all these, 
So I'm going to try and nope all these. This is a poss possible crash, but let's just try it. So nope to here. So we kn know that we noped. Seems to put you on So we're going to go from here. Um, don't know if this is a good idea to go to here, but um, hang on. We know that this. I'll probably leave that one out. Um, will I or will I? Will I not? Move EDX. EDX word. D word. Um, yeah, leave this one out. Leave this one out for now. So just put you out of the map. We try this one. Let's just do these. Uh, so I'm just gonna do a nope. All right. So let's try it. Um, oh, nice. So there you go. There it is. I I knew it was one of these. I knew it was below that. I mean, even without knowing, I I guessed that it would be right there because I kept getting recoil things. So as you can see, we're taking shots and absolutely no recoil. Now this can be tricky and it can take a while to find these things by yourself, but um, all I remembered from the last time I thingied was that I was getting positioned randomly and, and I even without knowing it I knew the first time I saw that I, th I saw it and I thought this must have something to do with recall and you won't always find that but sometimes you will so what we just blocked here from here to there um, from here to here is um, the recoil basically that's a recoil so recoil recoil starts here we go starts here and then um, note here so recoil ends here now if you get this and you're getting some sort of side effect for example if you're not getting recoil and you're getting a, fra a crash it's probably because you are noping one too many functions so it's usually just down to a call or to a jump or it if it's, it's most likely a call because a jump you can just block the jump and it block the whole function but um, if it's a call just uh, block the whole thing including the call because if it tries to call it and uh, all these values haven't been set then you will get crushed without a doubt so that's pretty much it that's our recall function we found um, what else could, could we want to found of course, might we want to found that was some bad English there um, so I mean this is it pretty, pretty much guys, I've taught you the most difficult one, I don't see the point of keep, go keep going but this is the idea, the idea is uh, to follow these steps here and keep leaving comments down and keep um, noping the functions and so on, reversing the jumps and so on so um, I want to put this um, this file will be in the um, in the description in case you want to use this for your own uh, instructions but it's really what it's about, I mean here are some instructions that sh probably should be ignored in most places, compare um, is usually only seen before jump, so just almost always ignore it. Uh, LEA is used for maths, um, maths calculations, like the more difficult ones. We usually ignore those as well, unless they're part of a group of instructions that applies to all of these. Uh, pop and push and return are usually just the end. Um, well, they're useless compared because we just want copy, which is move, uh, add, subtract, increment, and decrement are usually the ones we care about. Um, and that's it really, sorry, I hit the mic there, and that's pretty much it, ints are usually relevant, I don't know if I missed anything out, I don't think so, but yeah, feel free to download this and uh, have a look at the instructions here, um, these help me out every time I'm looking for something, but there is no straight way of doing this, uh, from what I know, there's some easier ways, there's doing it through cheat engine, which sometimes will give you the straight answer and stuff, and the instructions are the best way of doing it, especially when you're uh, playing games online, and you want to use mem copy or whatever, that way you um, you just block the instruction it's a lot less memory um, demanding as well so you just all you gotta do is nope the instruction once and then you never have to do anything again instead of having to refresh it every x milliseconds so I think this is pretty much it guys I think this tutorial lasted quite a while I hope this answers your questions guys so um, you know if not just uh, leave me a comment or yeah a comment would be best or a PM really if it's a big question um, and I'll try and answer it. Like I said, I've only been doing this for like a month and a bit, and um, I'm not an expert on the debug by any means, but I can find values. Like um, you've seen in some of my uh, games that I hacked, um, Modern Warfare is an example. Of this obviously, and I've done quite a few others, which um, I'll probably be uploading soon. Um, what else? Um, just the next thing is I'll probably I'll try and do uh, maybe a Left 4 Dead one left for dead um, hack I mean I'm trying to vary in games a little bit but games like um, I was gonna do Batman 
Arkham Asylum, but there's not much to uh, hack there. Uh, so that's pretty much it, guys. Um, I hope that answered your questions there. Um, yeah.